Hey, what's going on everyone? Chris back for another review and uh, today's update is actually for a big release for arguably one of the best musicals of all time and that of course is Grease and it's uh, celebrating its 40th anniversary and uh, you really can't believe it's been that long already. It came out in 1978 and I actually remember seeing this for the first time in uh, middle school where they uh, showed it in the auditorium and I just absolutely love the film, just the whole you know, look of the movie, the story was fun, and um, yeah, just the music numbers were great. Lots of great memories from this movie. So since it is its 40th anniversary, Paramount has given this classic the 4K treatment, which also includes brand new features. So regarding the presentation of Grease, this was actually sourced from the original 35mm negative, and it was given a brand new restoration for this 4K release, and it's the best the film has ever looked. And it does maintain that film-like feel rather than, you know, digitally enhanced, which is great. However, there are portions in this movie where the image becomes really soft and you unfortunately lose fine detail. But the main majority of the movie looks quite good. Great colors and decent black levels. But just keep in mind, you will see a hint of softness throughout the film, which is pretty much the case with all movies sourced from prints. Unless they are artificially sharpened. But thank goodness that isn't the case here. So overall my rating for the 4K presentation is a 4 out of a 5 for the picture quality. And I'm rating the DTS 5.1 mix a 4.5. And, and I'm also going to give the regular Blu-ray release of this movie. Which is also included in this edition a 4 out of a 5 for the picture quality as well. And since this edition includes new features it's worth a pickup. You get a new featurette called Grease A Chicago Story. Plus a new alternate animated main titles seen for the first time ever. So they basically went into the Paramount archives to find this. So it's uh, you know the main titles with the animation to a different song which was uh, you know never heard before. So that was pretty cool. Plus you get a new alternate ending. And all of the old features from the previous releases are also included with this release. Such as you know deleted extended scenes plus the Grease reunion and the Ride Out sing along. You get the introduction and uh, so much more. So all in all, I think it's still worth a pickup, even though it's not the most perfect transfer of the film. But I think they did the best they could with all the source material that was given to them for this release. And like I said, this is the best this film has ever looked. So anyway, that is my review of Grease making its 4K debut. Thanks for taking a look, guys, and I'll see you guys soon in my next review. Take care.